every bumper needs some speed holes. Unfortunately, because I was distracted by that, I made a cut across an angled face without flattening first. This means that those cuts aren't normal to the thickness, which will either be impossible to make depending on my equipment, or add unnecessary complexity. We can fix this very easily though. We'll flatten it, add a new sketch, and project both the front and back faces of the existing geometry, which will allow me to easily remove these complex angled cuts. When I'm done, I can refold it back up and move on to the next step. In the next step, I want to make you aware that the powerful direct editing capabilities you use in other parts of Fusion will work here as well. I want this front flange to come in a bit, so I'll grab my move face command, set the pivot at the inner corner, then rotate to my liking. 